think my mirror is lying to me, and I'm going to tell you why. No one questions how the stars light up the night sky. No one questions how the sun lights up the day and the moon lights up the night. So why do we question how other people look, what we can see, what we think about how other people look? And how we think about the way that we look. From my perspective, looks are one of those things that come and go. Who you are on the inside and in your soul and in your heart means more to me than what I can see in my mirror. But I still think my mirror is lying to me. In many ways, more than one. It tells me things that I don't need to know and things that aren't true. About me and about you. Over the years, me and my mirror have had long, long conversations about who we both are. But the mirror only tells me about me. It never talks about itself. Most of the time, I don't even care what the mirror has to say. What is looking back at me? But sometimes I catch a glimpse of what is written all over its face, and I question. Everything. busy week this week but like in a different way than it usually is for me I did a hospitality course so it was four days of all the hospitalities essentials that you'll need in the industry um, it was fantastic honestly couldn't fault it it was just so good to be able to like get the certificates and now be like okay I can do that if I need to do that you know what I mean because in this life, yes, the, the ultimate goal is fashion, art, creator. But in this life, you, sometimes you need a step one to then get to your goal. And my step one is being a barista, making coffee. So now I have the essential tools and to certifications to, to go do that and slay the house down boots because my passions in my life are coffee, fashion so makes sense but this is my literal last brain my name right is now. ander dingus and i got sour patch watermelon sour patch it just stop it's just strawberries anyway i'm the world's best dad
when someone calls me beautiful, hot, sexy, it almost makes me mad. Not because I don't believe them or don't think that those things are true. It's that I don't only want to be that in someone's eyes. Because I'm not just my body, not just what you can see. I'm smart, I'm grateful, I have ambitions, goals and dreams. I have beautiful friends, I'm a sister, I'm a daughter, I'm a creator, an artist. And out of all of that, a powerful woman. And yes, my body is my home. And yes, it's what people see first. But that's not all I am. 